Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I'm back with the Glowforge. I have been using this to make some projects for my kids that are extensions where I challenge them. I don't give them all the answers. I give them some of the answers, and then they get to actually start making cool stuff. My friends, I'd like to show you what's happening. All right, so the first project is just this nifty little stand. You can see that they cut their words, they glue them on a cardboard back, and then also part of the training was learning to create this shape so that it had the grooves to hold other pieces of cardboard, and then the whole project comes together. The second project is this little wagon. I call it the radio flyer, but it's made out of cardboard. And I show the students once again how to make those tabs so that everything interlocks as they build it. But then I challenge them to make theirs better than mine. I don't totally finish mine in the lesson. And here is where it's starting to get cool. I've got one student that's been working on this project already. You can see he has scaled it up to a crazy large size. He's still got to attach his little axle holders and then put the straws in and the wheels. We printed extra wheels because we might double them up to give it more strength. Also, another really neat thing, this is where he did his cutting and then had an oops moment. So they get to learn from their mistakes measuring, and it's just costing us cardboard, not anything real. And finally, perhaps the most awesome, we used white box learning gliders in our class. And this is the student's white box learning glider created totally on the Glowforge with cardboard. He's had three versions. You can see this one was not strong enough. So then he worked on strategies to make his fuselage more strong for flying. And now he's actually got the one that actually flies all the way across the room. And uh, it's pretty amazing. There isn't a lesson for that. But as you can see, with these basic building box skills, there's nothing they can't do with some cardboard tinker kit and a Glowforge. All right, friends, some more fun than telling you. Let's actually give you a test flight. <laughs> So we're still working on the balance, but as you can see, that plane totally has lift and is pretty darn sweet. And perhaps my favorite part is you've got zero material cost. It is cardboard, and there's lots of room for them to come up with other strategies how to build this. Uh, it's also sweet that the person took their real design and actually modeled it after using Tinkercad. They opened up white bikes learning, they took the measurements off the screen, and then they built their own version of it in Tinkercad. So I think it's going to be an unbelievably fun project with lots of room for them to say afterwards, what if, and create their own fun things for free. All right, friends. So the final thing is I have taken this and I have finally started to put it all on my website, hlmodtech.com. So I've done this, friends, because I don't assign these to the students. Like I said earlier, these are extensions. So I've got real lessons that the students are supposed to be doing, and this is what they do when they're done and they're pushing the limits. So when you go to hlmodtech.com, it is called Glowforging. And then on the Glowforging tab, first you've got the Name It. Then there's a cool challenge where you adjust it to actually sit on top of your monitor, which I have had students do successfully, and it's turning out well as well. This is the cardboard wagon, and then I'm going to keep adding the other ones down below. If you're looking closely, you can tell the stuff below the first row is gibberish. I am going to keep adding more and more stuff there, but uh, to be honest with you, I am a creator first and a website guy second. But this is what I need for my class, and I'm just willing to share it with you as well. Friends, if you found this useful, please hit that like button. If you got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit the notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.